So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear it for the professional fighters. Up first, in the blue corner, Chamber Siddiqui. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, for our first professional bout of the evening. Making his way to the cage is Chamber Sadiq, standing at 5 foot 11 inches, weighed in 175 pounds in a catch weight, with a record of 0 and 2 in the professional division. Just 30 years of age, representing America's Striker Academy out of Tracy, California. Chamber Sadiq's last fight was at Dragon House 29, where he lost to Joseph Cropshot via submission due to triangle choke. Chamber Sadiq is a very explosive fighter, uh, got power in both hands, very, uh, very, very well decorated grappler. Lost both of his fights though due to submission. So uh, we'll be looking to looking for uh, Chamber to keep this fight standing tonight, since he's lost uh, both of his fights due to submission. So uh, I'm definitely uh, expecting the Chamber to keep the fight standing. Doesn't want to touch the mat. So um, definitely has his hands full tonight as well, fighting Batsum Barrow Dagvador out of uh, Mongolia, Asia, who is also a very decorated striker. Very explosive grappler, very explosive athlete. So this should be a very great fight, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Chamber Sadiq now entering the cage with the orange and black fight trunks. Looks like he's ready and well prepared. Definitely looks like he's in great shape. His opponent. All the way from Mongolia. Batsambara Dove Torch. Now we talked about Batsambara Dove Vador earlier. We've seen him at the last couple of fights here at Dragon House as well as URCC 29. Man, this kid has this kid is a very great fighter. Has a lot to bring to the cage. Very explosive. I'm talking about power in both hands. Very explosive grappler. Very good wrestling, very good jujitsu. Taking on Chamber Sadiq. This should be a very good fight, folks. I'm expecting fireworks in, in this fight here between these two uh, welterweight fighters. And here we go. Batsamboro, Dagmador taking on Chamber Sadiq in our first professional bout of the evening. And for the official introduction, once again, here is the veteran voice of the Dragon House Cage. John once again, Ray ladies Boy. and gentlemen, welcome to you and welcome to everyone streaming live online to the professional portion of the Dragon House 30 fight car. In the blue corner. He's 24 years old and fights for American Striker Academy out of Tracy, California. He weighs 175 pounds. Inayat Chamber Siddiqui. His opponent in the red corner once again coming all the way from Ulaanbaatar, Mongolia. He is 31 years old, undefeated as a professional MMA fighter with a record of three wins and no losses. He fights for Team Voodoo. He is Betsambara Mongolian Falcon Dove Torch. Ladies and gentlemen, our referee for this first professional fight of Dragon House 30, the one and only Ed Colantes, our veteran referee. Chamber Siddiqui in the blue corner and Batsam Birel Darvorj in the red corner. This is a catchweight 175 pound fight. And round number one is officially underway. Now, keep in mind, Chamber Siddiqui, he's lost a couple of fights in a row, but that says absolutely nothing about his skill. This guy is not afraid to take on the very best fighters 
in his weight class in California. He's lost to Ivan Batnich and Joseph Kropschatz in his first two pro fights. Those guys are savages, and he's doing nothing less than that, taking on Batsambiro Davidorj. Now, Batsambiro Davidorj, undefeated as a professional fighter, normally fights at 170. He's moved up to catch weight 175, and what's interesting about this guy, he's actually uh, performed on the Mongolian SWAT team as a police officer. So both of these guys have no fear in their hearts, and they are absolutely oh, nice, incredible really. fighters. Nice head kick just missed there by uh, Extreme Sadiq. amounts of athleticism and no fear between either fighters. And right now, Chamber Siddiqui going for a takedown, and he takes down Batsambiro Davidorj. That might be the first time Davidorj has been taken down in his MMA career. Siddiqui looking to capitalize on a takedown. Batsambiro back to his feet and reverses the situation. Landing into side control. Wow, incredible grappling on this way by Batsambiro. Now, Dagvidorj, the Mongolian, has brought a huge crowd out for both URCC and Dragon House MMA in the past. And they are definitely here tonight, Tusi. Yeah, definitely definitely a big fan, fan support from uh, uh, the Mongolian Falcon here. Samuel does such a nice job of just controlling on the top position. And it's interesting because normally when you take down a fighter and you end up in their full guard, you have the potential to be in danger. Your risk, you, you risk of getting caught in an armbar or a triangle or a guillotine choke. But Batson Pedrell just doesn't care. He'll just punch you no matter what risk you put him at. Batson Barrel back to his feet now. The killer instinct of Batsambiro Dagador is something that we've never seen here before. And there are 10 seconds left to go in round number one. And as a reminder, all of our professional fights tonight consist of three minute rounds. With that being said, round number one comes to a close. As round number one comes to a finish, I'm definitely gonna have to give that round in favor of Batsambiro Dagador. Uh, was able to land a takedown there and stay in dominant position for a uh, the majority of that round there, so I'm gonna have to give that a 10-9 in favor of Batsambiro. No, I don't know what's going on, but it looks like referee Ed Kalanta has just called off the fight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ed Kalanta has just canceled this fight. For an unknown reason, this fight is over. Well, it looks like, uh, it looks like Chamber, Chamber Sadiq, Sadiq may have not feeling well. Yeah, he may have broken a finger or dislocated one of his fingers or whatnot. So uh, it looks like the fight's over. I'm going in. Still no word of exactly what happened there in that first round. It's either a, a, a hand or an arm, one or the other. But something is definitely wrong with Chamber Sadiq. You can see, you can see the, uh, you can see the intense hurt in his, in his uh, eyes right now. Looks like he's in a lot of pain. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner, three minutes into round number one via TKO due to injury of his opponent in the shoulder, Betsambero Dove Torch, the Mongolian Falcon. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Batsambiro Dagvador, 
gets the victory via referee stoppage. It looks like uh, Chamber City cannot continue due to a shoulder injury. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with your winner, Batson Bureau. First of all, congratulations on another incredible professional MMA fight. First of all, what went into preparing for this fight? Uh, back in Mongolia, in Ulaanbaatar, we trained for this fight two months. Now you're 3-0, oh, you're undefeated in professional MMA. What is your ultimate goal here fighting in MMA? I want to go into UFC Bellator, I want to win the championship. Well, you know what? You were nothing short of very impressive. That was an incredible performance. Ladies and gentlemen, Batsa Burel, congratulations on another impressive, incredible performance. Congratulations on your win tonight. Congratulations to Batson Barrow DeVorge uh, defeating Chamber Sadiq here in round number one via referee stoppage.